Okay, we've done guitars one and two. Let's move on to three. Solo number three, see what it sounds like. We'll get rid of this bus fader here. Let's hear track three. <laughs> Okay, a little rhythmic part here. Sounds like it has a bit too much reverb. Let's turn that down just a little bit. Okay, that'll do for that. That actually sounds okay. Let's move on to track four. a direct re recording directly plugged into the 002 the guitar is no amp or mic or anything and it sounds like it's hitting a little bit hard let's try putting a compressor on there and see if we can smooth it out a little bit let's go with the compressor limiter dyne 3 the new one okay what do we got <laughs> Sounds pretty good, but maybe a little bit too much threshold. Let's try turning it down just a tad. Or up, actually, so that it doesn't compress quite as much. Play again. setting seems to work. Let's go with that. Now we could also use a longer delay on this one so we'll set up yet another auxiliary track after the phase shifting track. So we go to track, new, stereo, aux, create. And this one will be long delay. Okay, make it bigger so we can see. Fix up the solo. Let's add the long delay setting. And that's really long, so let's go down to in the 300 range on that side and in the 400 range on the other side add a little bit of feedback so we can get a little bit more a few more repeats trying to get an echoplex sound okay fix our input to be the next available pair of buses seven and eight turn our level up go to track four let's bus out from seven and eight Okay, and let's see what this sounds like. That's pretty busy. Let's try uh, adjusting the times to be a little bit shorter. This is roughing in. still a little bit busy sounding. Let's turn one side down some more. A little bit more feedback. Okay. Now if we turn it down a lot, It's not too noticeable. Let's check that out. Okay, I'll go with that. A 
Okay, very good. All the tracks are fixed up with their various effects.